What's up guys, Nex here. Today we are back, back with Dorian, and we are reading another story. Uh, sorry, there are three of these, or maybe two of these in a row on my channel. I don't know if the last one went up or something. My editing software is currently broken, so I can't edit really well. I have a separate, a separate kind, uh, but it has audio issues, so I'm not sure about that. There's no real order to them, really. Okay. So, this may be number one or number two. Or That's number basically what I'm saying. I'm not doing that many episodes of these. <laughs> yet. yet. That might happen in a couple of years during the series, but for now, no. Anyway, so this one is Ghost on Masong Tunnel. Masung. 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 You're saying you can speak the language? Nope. Okay. Don't go slow. You'll miss Anime everything. chick. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Per <laughs> okay, when I first saw this right here, I was like, Ghost Llama? <laughs> Ghost Llama. <laughs> like, if you stuck ears there and an eye there, it looks like a Ghost Llama. Okay. It was several. 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 I heard that voice crack. Shut up. It was several years ago. I was on my way to my hometown, alone, on an express bus. <sighs> staring at a book. Staring more intently at a book. <laughs> or the back of your seat. <laughs> there were only ten or less passengers seated here and there. As the bus slid into a tunnel, with the surrounding becoming dark. I let my eyes shut, closing the book I was reading. On the bus... Oh, yeah, I, I totally read that right. I let my eyes shut, closing the book I was reading on the bus to kill boredom of a long bus ride home. Wait, first it was a train? No, it, it's always been a bus. Oh, okay. Nice background gradient. Wonder how they did that. Um, oh, you can't see the spoiler up there. Cool. Um, it wasn't long before I fell asleep. I might have been pretty tired. Some time has passed. I opened my eyes again and stared outside the window to find we were still looking at the glaring red white, and the bus was running continuously. Continuous. <laughs> oh, how you just hide behind. Oh, I just want to get a good view on your okay. face. Uh, still look at glaring the red while the bus was running continuously. I misread that. I apologize. Why are you screwing around with that? Shh. Sorry. <sighs> Since it felt. I'm going to put my tea down because obviously there's a jump scare. Since I felt as if it quite a long time, quite a long lapse of time, I just thought it was another tunnel, different from the one where I fell asleep. But no matter how far the bus ran, <coughs> yo, this, yo, totally professional here, guys. Totally professional. <coughs> yeah, there was no end to the tunnel. No jump scared? Seriously? No? No. no. Not happening? No. <laughs> Sorry, I was having a giant voice crack there. Um, It's okay. It seemed as if an air from somewhere outside this world was surrounding me, giving me an awkward and discomforting feeling. I had chill, chills, chills all over my body. Do you even speak English? <laughs> no, I don't even English. I don't even English, bro. Yep. I leaned over to the corridor to have a better glimpse of inside. That one guy looks like he's dead. No, he's napping. He's just simply taking a nap. Let my imagination have some creativity, please. I'm kidding. It's all right. One of those is very bad. One, the other one is very bad because I have a migraine right now. Sorry. Uh, all of the passengers seem to be asleep. 
letting their bodies slip to the side. However, it did not give me a clear view to the seats and higher backs. No jump scare. I turned around to see the the tail part of the bus. To find the... See, they're dead. I told you. I know. I was just screwing around with you. Douche. I already read ahead of it already, so I know know what's going to happen. (laughs) He read both before I did, so... And he saw the other one before I read it. To find out some of the passengers lying on the floor with fatal damages to their body. Mm. Well, that was professional. I just burped on camera. (sighs) I'm so sorry, guys. I'm kind of a mess today. Uh, (laughs) To find some of the passengers laying on the floor with fatal damage to their body and bleeding heavily. The feeling of a terrible accident crossed my mind, and then suddenly, snap. And just I can kidding. hear the quakiness of your voice. <laughs> I'm not really scared, it's just kind of... Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I just love you better than <clears throat> mood swings. <laughs> yup. I'm kind of living off a of tea during this recording, so my voice doesn't completely go. A creepy, weird noise came from out. Came from the front. Snap, snap. Jump scare. I wonder if those snappings are people's necks breaking. Oh god, that sounds. <laughs> Just like snap. Oh my god. Each snap is somebody dying. All right, snap. Snap. That's a cute little creature. Oh. No actual jump scare, just a creature at the front of the bus. I really have to be. Another shot of the creature at the front of the bus. And it looks like it's actually breaking people's necks. Is the bus sideways now? The bus kind of looks like it's sideways almost. Actually, no, that's a cleaver. The bus is not sideways, it's a cleaver. I'm smart. <sighs> Another picture of the cleaver. Jobs. <laughs> you know what? That's actually really cool looking. <clears throat> Props to the artist on that one. Jump scare is over. Okay. Well, it's not over yet. Wait, wait, go back up. Sexy face. Ooh, right. so sexy. 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 From then on, I do not have an exact memory. Clink, clink. I panic. The bull. T. I'm almost out now. <sighs> yeah, especially really having to pee during reading a horror story. Clank, clank, I panicking, panickingly pushed my seat belt button to loosen myself until the fingernail, until all fingernails, yep, that's proper English, all of my fingernails were broken into pieces, but clank, clank, please. I'd be terrified. Clank. Strangely, my seat belt did not move a bit. Oh, another jump scare. It's like a face hugger on a bus. It crawled under the seat and it's like, Hi, really? you want to have some fun? Dude, that was freaking mm. terrifying for me. Why the hell did <laughs> I don't know. You're just scared easily and I'm not. See, one thing you'll notice is only really FNAF scares me. Bump. I bet that's what he's doing to that chick. Yep. Innuendos for the win. The knife of the child went straight through my thigh, leaving me in burning pain and stripped myself of consciousness. Just like, hey, this is my consciousness now. And that's the last of my tea, so sorry about the voice. Ah, yeah, that's my voice went again. I was going to try it. <laughs> I was trying to say, and there we go, but it kind of ended up just being a 
bit of silence and then a squeak. I heard. Yeah, it was uh, like a ah, kind of thing. That was creepy. I thought that was the no. computer. I'm like, what the hell? It was my <laughs> voice. I woke up to find myself in a hospital ward. There might have been a terrible accident. TV newsmen were on to report the accident. This accident every day. The bus collision in Maya Sung, in Maya Sung Tunnel, in the Maya Sung Tunnel. Eight were dead, including the driver, leaving only myself and another passenger alive. <sighs> People say I was in a coma for two days with severe damage to my leg and an injury to the head. <clears throat> Please, why you do this to me? <clears throat> so it, the bus did turn up sideways. Yeah. It was definitely sideways. But they say I survived because the seatbelt protected me from bouncing out of the bus. <laughs> boing, 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 boing. I think I just see a bus on hydraulics boinging down the hall in the you have street. A sick, you have a sick mind. What? That's What's sick. wrong with a bus doing jump rope? Doing uh, jump roping. Why are you disassembling my erector set dog? Erector? What? <laughs> That's what it's called, no, erector set. I'm, I'm tightening it a little bit. Oh, okay. That's cool. Because it is loose. As goose. Billy goose. <laughs> Billy goose. And I can just, just, just talk. <laughs> okay. It's not over yet. Yeah, I know. There is about... Nah, a little left. It shouldn't take that much. Hey, this one looks like it'll be about a 15 minute episode. Cool. 50? 15, not 50. Jeez. I'm sorry. Sorry, that, that would just be a really long recording session for one story. I tried to convince the nurse, the doctor, and dyslexia investigating the case about the kid I saw on the bus, but no one seemed to believe me. Another survivor was still in a coma. He is in a ward right next to mine. That person, probably, yeah. might have seen what I saw on the bus. It's like a gremlin. You haven't seen the show, you wouldn't get it. I, I've seen or it. I've seen it. We're, dead we're... like me. Huh. Why do you poke? Dead Like Me is a very good show. Uh, I don't know if it's on Netflix or not, because I don't have a Netflix. <laughs> if it is, go watch it immediately. It's amazing. <sighs> Another jump scare. <laughs> <laughs> See, that actually scared me more than any other jump scare on this. <laughs> is there any more jump scares? I don't actually, know. don't answer that. <sighs> there buried a family in a mountain of Sork Song. I don't know if I said that right. <laughs> Located in the. Uh, I give up. <laughs> Decapitated. <laughs> Decapitated. <laughs> Decapitated. Oh, uh, really? What? I tried to say decapitated. Still, <clears throat> that's wrong. But with a G instead of a C. Decapitated to death due to one of the wrong few. Wrong. English. <laughs> I just suck at English. I'm sorry, guys. My head really hurts right now, so I'm having a hard time speaking properly. Speaking proper. Traitors by King Wong Hai. As I one of them was a little child who started to say a few words. The spirit of a young child looking like half a rotten corpse used to come down to the village and claimed tens of people. Claimed. Yep, you're right. Oh, hi, you're so cute. Oh, you have a meat cleaver. Can I have your cleaver? It looks like a good carbon steel cleaver. <laughs> Actually, I don't think it was rusty. Uh, and again, not all carbon steel things are oh, rusty. You whacked. <laughs> uh, wait. Why you unscrew? You screw. Having heard about the traffic, traffic, 
tragic, tragic story. Wang Hei placed a large rock. And I feel like I'm going to throw up now. Give me a second. No, sometimes my body is just like, no, you shall not keep your food. This isn't your food anymore. <laughs> yep. Okay, large rock on the field where the family is buried and the ghost of a child was never to be seen again. I accidentally scrolled up instead of down. The Mazong Tunnel, where the accident took place, runs through Saint er, through Mount Solksong and was Solksong. opened for... Sure. In 1994. I was expecting a jump scare right there. Oh. 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 <laughs> okay, there's the... <laughs> there is definitely one. Ah. Uh. <laughs> Dang it. So much tension, and then nothing. <laughs> if there was a jump scare, you would have actually gotten scared. Yeah, I probably would have. There, because <sighs> all of the tension built up. Mainly from me, just going like, huh? No, I, uh, I was doing enough by myself. That was just annoying. Shut up. <laughs> okay. okay. Well, I hope you enjoyed this episode of Next Reads. This is probably the last episode for a while, unless we record more today. I don't know. But I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, let me know. If you didn't, let me know so I can improve. Let me know what I can do. General stuff. I'm anyway. off at that sexy face. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.